Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all spot on. Thanks for watching the video. Now I've been shopping. I've been to Asda. Come and have a look at what I've got. Having a little walk around Asda as you do, I come across this. Um, Asda beef slices in gravy. It's a Just Essentials. 210 grams. The little traffic light system there, look, and there is the serving suggestion. Now this was 90 pence. I couldn't believe it, 90 pence. We're gonna to have to see what it's like, aren't we? So let's have a look at the box. A little bit of nutritional information there. Look, if you wanna pause that, by all means, go ahead. And above it are the ingredients. And a little bit of spiel, I'll just read that. Cooked sliced beef silver side with added pea protein in gravy. Um, allergens are barley, silver side beef, 24%, big beef silver side, 96%. They are the cooking instructions. Cook from frozen, which this is. Remove tray from carton. Microwave from frozen, 700 watts, six and a half minutes, 900 watts, five minutes. So according to your wattage of your microwave, you'll adjust the time accordingly. Alternatively, you can you cook it from frozen there. In the oven, fan 180, 200 degrees, gas six for 40 minutes. That's great if you've got all other things in the oven that you're cooking. You can just pop this in, can't you? This is going to go in the microwave. Little thing, recycling there, 210 grams, a GB sticker. Let's get this open and see what we've got. It's only Diddy, but, you know, 90 pence. 90 pence. Says pierce the lid several, the film lid several times. And I normally like to give it an ass, but I'm gonna I'm only gonna give it a three three shots. Because I was told in the comments, you know, just pierce it a couple of times because you want it to sort of really cook in there instead of letting all the sort of the steam out. But we'll give it a whirl and see what it's like. I'm going to put it in the microwave and I will bring you back when it's done. It's hard at three minutes and now we have to do the seal peel test. You have to give it a stir halfway through. Oh yes, look at that. 90 pence and it's just come off. That's brilliant. Because it is still a bit frozen. There's the beef. Oh, look at that. Now it's going to go back in for another three minutes and I will bring you back when it's done. It's done. Let's have a look at this. Now I know you don't eat it like this. You have it on a, well, you can have it with mashed potatoes, on a roast. You can have it how you like, but because I'm reviewing it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what it's like like this. Ooh, look at that. It, the gravy is, is a little bit thin, but you know, what, 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 you can always thicken that up, can't you? Because it's red hot, I'm gonna get it on the plate now. I'll just pour it on so you can see. Yeah, you can see what it's like then, can't you? Get all that gravy out, don't want to be wasting anything. It? It's definitely not a share, eh? That's fish, do we? <laughs> Put that there. And I'll, I'll get this, I'll sort of open it up for you so you can have a good look at it. You need to know what you're buying and what you're getting. I'll do a little, oh, it's a little, it's a little, is that a heart shape? No, it's not, is it? <laughs> Have a look at that. See what you think. I'll zoom in if I can and show you. It's very thin. It's it's going to be thin, isn't it? You're not going to get big wedge wedges, you know, of gravy. Probably transparent. Looks, I mean, yeah, 90 pence, remember. You've got to remember 90 pence. Right, it's taste test time now. If you like this kind of video, please give it a thumbs up. And um, if you've not subscribed, maybe consider subscribing. Um, it does help the channel and it is free. Let me know if you've had this um, beef slices in gravy before. I can't wait to try it, I really can't. So I'm going to now, right now. <laughs> See what it's all about. Shh. 
show you. And gravy. I love beef as well, I really do. In fact, I love all sorts of food, really. Mmm. That, that gravy's tasty as well, it's rich. The beef's tender. Wow, I'm amazed at that gravy. I know it's the beef is the star of the show, like, but it's got to be tasty, the gravy that it's in, isn't it? And that, that gravy's pretty, pretty tasty. It is. I did the Just Essentials gravy. I did a comparison between the Just Essential gravy and the Bisto. Wow. Yeah, the Bisto gravy was a little bit more richer, but... God, not a lot in it. Not a lot in it at all, to be honest. And the prices were staggering. So obviously the, the gravy's good, isn't it? It's all right. I reckon it'll be be done better. It's a little bit, a little bit, not not so much dry because it's got gravy on it. But you know it's been done in the microwave. I dare say if you did it in the oven. You know, it would probably be the, the the meat would be a lot better, but it's it's not bad. It's not bad at all. God, I'm absolutely. I can't believe it. You can tell it's been done in the microwave, but it, you know, it's all right. It really is all right. And that gravy's tasty as well. Mmm. Oh. It can actually taste beef as well. <laughs> For a frozen product, microwave, they normally taste pretty bland, aren't they? And you know, no flavour, but you can actually taste the beef. The gravy's the gravy's good as well. It's lovely. Wow. Oh yeah, that over chips as well. That'd be lovely, that, all that gravy over chips. Some buttery mashed potato, carrots and peas. Oh. Can't fault it, to be honest. There's nothing wrong with that. There really isn't. Obviously, you know, you know, it's, it's really thin and it's nothing like, you know, it's just, you get what you pay for at the end of the day, but that's okay. It really is okay. I'm not, that gravy is not going to waste. Now I'm going to get some bread and butter out and mop it all up. Look at it. No fat or gristle in there that I've come across. It's all, it's all edible. Mm. I like it. Definitely nothing wrong with that at all. I would buy it again, yeah, it's good. Very, very good. Give it a whirl, see what you think. So thanks very much for watching. Thanks for all the people who've joined the channel membership and, and joined and, and, and who watch as well. It's It's been amazing, it's been fantastic. See you on the next video, so take care, all the best, and I'll catch you on the next one.